The introduction of the runes for Diablo Immortal, in my opinion, was uh, one of the better things that came with the last major update. I am enjoying what the runes are giving me right now, and as we upgrade them to the next tier, the benefit that we get is just only getting better. And now that we have the uh, yellow runes inside of the game, those are extremely powerful, I would say, uh, giving us dash, dash kill cooldown that is big, stun resistance, and continual damage reduction. I mean, all of that is pretty good here, uh, not only for PvE, but for PvP. A lot of these uh, uh, magic attributes that we are used to get on our primary gear pieces are now on the rune especially like beneficial duration attack speed and uh, uh, all the good stuff that we try and get on our primary gear pieces uh, but there is one big issue uh, for the runes in my opinion and that is the synthesizer option here if we were to craft a fa uh, rune here we need three copies of tyr uh, and uh, uh, we can click here it will show us we need three copies of tyr and then uh, uh, then to craft this we need three copies of cir here so that is a bit too complex in my opinion especially when you have some runes uh, you have the order of crafting just go a bit messier here for example i want to craft uh, this here uh and an ie and i thought i would need uh, three copies of N O U, but if I click here, it says I need three copies of W E S. So if you have some copies already available, so it will mess up the order of crafting here. That is somewhat a bit messier in my opinion. So uh, what they can do to make this a lot more simpler in my, in my opinion, uh, instead of us uh, uh, have to craft, for example, uh, again if I want to craft the ECE, I need three copies of RAE. Uh, what they can do is, if we go to the runes, just give us an option to salvage all our runes. Each rune can give us uh, like uh, a one a gray power. So if I were to salvage all of these runes, I would get one gray power for each. And if I go to the rune smithing, it will just give me a requirement to craft this you need three gray power to craft the next one you need six gray power 9 12 uh, 15 18 and so on and so forth that is how the crafting would work and uh, then there would be a conversion option to convert the gray uh, rune material to the uh, next year one that would be blue so we can convert the gray one to the blue. So the next one will again need the three blue rune material and six, uh, nine, 12, 15 and so on and so forth. Then we can convert the blue rune material to the uh, yellow one with the conversion and uh, just easily click on the rune that we want to craft when we have enough rune material. I think that is going to be a lot more uh, simplified than the uh, system that we have uh, not everyone is going to be like going through this uh, uh, every time they want to craft it takes time and you need to make sure that you are crafting the right one because once you have some rules the order isn't accurate so either they have to fix the order so it doesn't change once you acquire some rune and uh, so it is easier to know that uh, you just keep uh, upgrading to the next 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 and the order isn't changing that would be a uh, one solution and in future they can add an option to salvage the runes and just use the uh, rune dust to craft uh, the runes i think that would be a lot easier and simpler uh, system than what we have right now for a uh, rune crafting or rune Synthesize. Like I said, these runes are really powerful and something that is going to be uh, needed in future. But also their uh, drop rate is currently horrendous. So maybe they will have to increase that uh, as well. But anyhow, that is just me 
uh, wanting to talk about the uh, rune crafting system that in my opinion is a bit very messier and they can make it a lot more simpler anyhow i'm signing off see you all in the next one later guys